What's up everyone? It's your friend 23 here and welcome back to another video. We we ended the last video with the flying across the map from there all the way here. And why we did that is because we're gonna help these dudes fight I guess this castle today. So that's gonna be a bit hectic I think. And also this one we shouldn't forget so I'm gonna just beam it for now. And it would also be nice to unlock the map here. But I see we're at the edge, so I guess... I guess that one is for this this map area, and that's a bit too far for me. I wanna do that one later though, so I'm gonna, be, be, I'm gonna beam that as well. Okay, are we ready for this? Do I even have weapons? I do. <laughs> Maybe not the best weapons, but I have weapons. Let's see what this dude Hi. says. Link, hello. <laughs> it's an honor to see you again. We're moving on. We're moving in on a monster base up ahead. They've dug. They've dug in once again. After we approach, after we approach, we will wait for the right moment, and then launch our attack. Nothing would make me happier than to have you assist Hi. us again. Please join us. We can bring peace back. To this land if we work together of course i will um, join you guys i love your gear like a broom and a bucket and you think you can destroy monsters with that okay i guess they have seen us already yeah we're angry okay we don't have arrows that's not so fun but if we start this fight off with a big explosion I think that's actually pretty okay. <laughs> okay. It's always the same thing when I start the game for the day. <laughs> All the controls are out of my uh, short term memory. I guess equip this one. And I also see that sword over there. Wow. You broke my shield, huh? <laughs> And then this is gonna go break, so why not throw it to, for some crit damage? Nice. That sword is already broken. Things breaks way too easy, <laughs> if you ask me. It, that... There I died because I didn't even think about my life. It's not the best start we could have. Why is this dude, like, <laughs> unkillable? Yeah, I took your um, stick. What you're gonna do about it? You're gonna throw things on me instead? I don't think that's quite enough for you. Oh, wow. This dude is so tanky. <laughs> what the hell? Black Bokolobin Horn. That's a lot of damage. Oh god damn, I thought I had time to jump and I had, but he was waiting with his attack. Okay, now we're full health again. Wow. Are you gonna attack me? Probably wanna drop. Uh... I don't wanna take that good one because these dudes are really tanky. Oh, that's a nice block. Let my dudes tank <laughs> so I don't have to tank the damage. Whoa, he's angry. He's throwing his friends away. Ah, oh, that's bad. Uh, this dude is scary. Ah, oh, nice. Now we just spam this. Hmm. Stop throwing your friends on me. 
I need to heal. I don't wanna risk it. We're doing pretty okay. <laughs> like we're... Oh, damn. As soon as I said that, we take a lot of damage. Yes, munch on some apples for now. Yeah, nice. But it's no good that almost two of my shields broke. Yeah, we take this long stick and just... Just put one of these on. Now he can't touch me because I have range. Are like all my friends dead or have they w went into the... Um, to the fortress? Button mashing just right now. Thought I would have time to jump back. Wasn't that a perfect, uh, perfect dodge? Okay, we get a lot of loot and damage at least, which is nice. Uh, not damage, I mean weapons. <laughs> uh, Bokolo, Boko, Bokoblin guts. A rare material obtained by defeating a Bokoblin. It convulses on its own every now and then, which is really creepy, but perhaps Perhaps it has a use. Perhaps, perhaps. <laughs> we got killed. Oh, we have some some few left here. Dude, are you dead? <laughs> I hope you can wake up soon. <laughs> Otherwise, this um, this army will if they lose like two or three per fight, this army will be. Will be empty of people in one or two more fights. Another incredible battle. I'm not sure if it was incredible. I took way too much damage and wasted a lot of durability on my on my shields. Uh, with you on our side, Link, we can take on any threat. I guess that's true, at least. <laughs> ah, I nearly forgot. Please accept this reward as a thanks for your help. Yeah, I, w I was thinking I need. I should get a pay rise. Because that was a harder battle than the first one. And I did get a pay rise. So thank you for that. Of course, the true battle is yet to come. Have you seen it, Link? The Blood Moon, I mean. I've saw seen it once. When it rises in the sky, monsters will flood the land again and threaten the peace in Hyrule again. My squad members will rest and rebuild their energy to prepare for its return. Ah well, I do look forward to fighting by your side again. May the fight with Goddess Helias, Divine Protection, Brave Swordsman. Blah, 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 blah. A lot of words. So let's loot. Finish looting this place. Yes, I'm gonna drop that one because I have used it sometimes. <laughs> Wow. Let me just munch on my apple. Wow, again I do that? I'm really stupid. Did we have a, another bow? So we're gonna probably drop the last five bow we have. Take that instead. And then I'm gonna just take this silent room because it's shining so bright. And here is another one of these, these silent princesses. I could have used this in the fight if I wanted. So this is just, uh, I thought we would have a fortress of some kind here, but I guess not. 
there is a shrine. I already marked it. Probably last episode. So now we need to think a bit. What what are we gonna do right now? Actually, if that's that thing, yeah. The green one is exact. The green one, and we had. Didn't we have one over here? I swear to God, I didn't. I. Yeah. I, oh. Okay. I never put a pin on that because it's too far away. That's correct. We're gonna do this one. Is it so nearby? Then we really need to find uh, some sort of stable soon, because I need a horse. This makes me mad. <laughs> Being like almost 10 hours in without a horse. In short, the first 4 hours was in the tutorial island. Also, I should be ready for the... Or some type of bat attack, and this time I actually want to use a bomb if they come. I really don't come. Because I wanted all those eyes if I could. these enemies or is it something I can collect? Probably can kill them. I'm gonna kill one just to secure it. Sticky lizard. The suction of its toes allow this lizard to easily climb to the walls. Here is the elixir we needed for the for last episode in that uh, that watery cave. So I guess when we mix this for an el elixir we're gonna get some sticky feet as well. Those I actually want more than one of. Oh my oh my god, that's a lot of enemies. The thing is Can we aggro the trolls first? Because at least they were pretty easy to kill and then we can focus on that big larva thingy. So yes, come here. I'm no I'm no dangerous. You will probably win over me, if you try. Just drop down here, come on. Are you gonna... You're gonna be on the wall forever, and your spear is super long? <laughs> what the hell? Can you just... I will shoot you if you don't jump down. You give up. Okay. Let's backtrack to this. After we have collected some more arrows. I'm gonna... I'm gonna travel back and buy some arrows. Let me ask this cave we haven't done. So we wanna... Put it like that. Just so we know that it's not finished. <laughs> And that's all the things. So how near are we one of these main quest thingies? Pretty far, huh? Uh, uh, uh. So let me just... Take me home. So I can... Go and buy, because I know it, it. arrows are for sale over here. It's a bit framey in the beginning here. It'll usually clear up in any second.
Here we have the arrows. 20 each. Let's buy them all. But I wouldn't... So she restocks. So if I sleep, do I restock the store? Let's try that for now. I'm gonna take the middle bed for now. When I went to bed now, it was 3 o'clock and now it's 5, so it's only 2 hours. So maybe she hasn't had time to restock then? No. This is just for me trying, so I'm gonna do... ...another until morning. So now we're gonna sleep for basically 24 hours. And now it's the blood moon, I guess. Yeah. When the glow of the blood-stained moon shines upon the land. We have seen this before. We know what's happening. Everything respawns. Yeah, she has restocked. Nice. So I guess once per day, or once per 24 hours, oh. store will restock. Ah. Now we should have 50, yeah. That should be enough for now. Uh, and we. Cannot really fast travel there. We should have gone to some type of shrine there, so we would have a teleport. That was pretty stupid of me. What is this pin, actually? The red one. Yeah, I can't even see what it is. But anyways, let's go to the, to the green here. And unlock the map. Was it the blue, the purple that was the map? It's this, the green one, correctly. I was just way off in my in my aiming. Okay, so I guess this is closer. Nice. Line me up, please. Then it was green, if I'm remember correctly. So I think we haven't found a stable yet, or maybe some stable should be over here somewhere. But it feels like somewhere on this map party, because we have a lot of roads here. Somewhere here it should be a stable, I feel like. Or I hope so, at least. Because <laughs> I really need a... Oh, that's a shrine I'm not gonna wanna forget. And also, I don't need to put pin on every shrine. It's easier first pin it and then edit it to uh, to one of those. Because then I know here is a shrine I haven't done. Same here. 
do that. Open map. This one. Perfect. Oh, I need to drop. <laughs> That's not good. I'm gonna fall into the water. Ah. I need to <laughs> recharge the energy a bit here. There we go. Okay, so what do we have here? It's an abandoned little place. Saw the enemies over there. I'm not sure I'm gonna engage with them. That's great, actually. Uh, it's is this their like spot that they chill at, and I wanna run away from that spot before they arrive. Back home. Gonna use the climb uh, ascend thing here. I wonder even if I can do it. If I go up here. Here I should be able to stand. Yeah. Oh, please. Dude, you could st you could stand there. Oh. Yes, not. And now it's of course it starts raining as soon as I approach the mountain. It's like the game knows. The game knows what I wanna do. Then it gives me rain. How should I be able to climb this wall now? Are we like possible? Is is this enough? So no. So if we go over there, maybe. And now we're like screwed because <laughs> we can't even climb here. It's gonna fall down. Yeah. Ah. I hate the rain. It always comes at the wrong time. Let's see. We have a fly thingy, but... <laughs> We have nothing to fly with. Mm, let's go to that one and rewind it and then we can... If we even... Have time, I'm not sure, because <laughs> the swimming is slow as well. This is like the the worst possible way you could have explored to that um, sky tower. <laughs> I've been on all places without loot and everything. That's enough. That's really close of dying. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is not the most fun to watch, but we're soon, soon, soon there. There is a spring as well. I should have just walked as a normal person. Okay, let's try if the rewind still works. It does. Nice. And how far up can we go? Let's just try it the whole way. Just to find out what type of heights you can get. Can I recall it again? I can. It's crazy. So now I can get... Okay, this is maximum range. Okay. But this is nice, because now we can... Uh, now we can just glide. We didn't even have to wait for the water to... The rain to end. And let's just do a quick... Quickie here as well. So we have it for some other day. What happens if you like approach from the top? I guess it's just you're just stuck up here until you jump down. Okay, so we got a birdie here. How strange. Did you come to see the sky view tower? My apologies. It looks like we have a small problem over here. So what's the problem? I heard that the terminal at the sky view tower needs repair, so I came to fix it, but... The door won't open, and I have no clue why. The door isn't locked, but it won't budge, no matter how hard I push or pull. Ah, of course, I mean... Oh, ah, of course, I know it's a sliding door. That's what I meant, obviously. I worked up an appetite getting my brain into gear for this. I bet the nearby caves would have some tasty mushrooms. Caves? Yep, there are caves at the bottom of this hill. I used to go mushroom hunting in them all the time while we, while we were building the tower. So you want some type of mushroom. Or is it like you can come up from underneath? Down the hill, he said. A cave. I saw that loot. I guess that's the cave. Looks like an entrance. Yeah. <gasps> and I'm stupid. I should have anticipated that. Could have gotten a lot of loot. This is... This is a deep cave. Wow. That sound scared me a bit. <laughs> what was that? Okay. We need to go out and find a stone. I, fi I know where a stone is. We have stones here. Right. Let's just clear this. And you can taste that power as well. <laughs> Did they hit each other? Oh, that's a lot of damage. Almost a one hit. Let me... I need the full health, because if he hits me again, I'm dead. If I don't have full health, that would say. Ow! Oh, I'm scared. It will hit me now. Oof. 
Nice. Take his goddamn sword before he can pick it up. That's great. Blue horribin, horrib, horriblin, horriblin horn. A hammer shaped horn with some bits. Like, is it something to the left also? Or is it only to the. Oh! They have hided a weapon. This looks like it can be a Kuroko seed. Maybe it's just easier to throw a bomb. Let's try it. Let's not try it. <laughs> yeah, I saw that coming miles away. When I go through it. So now we have used up our... Um, all the fairies we had, I guess. Ah. Oh. This is just an other way to get there. I guess we're gonna take that claymore as soon as this thing breaks. Damn an enemy, no, that's just some vegetables. Was that every all? Splash fruits. A fruit contains pressurized water. Cooking it brings out an ability to enhance swim speed. Nice. But I'm a bit... Like, what, what shroom did he he want from me in this game? Because I already had the shroom that I found. <laughs> Let me just... I want to break this. Nice. I almost forgot. missed this one. I guess that's it. Blue nightshades. Cook it to get some extra stealth. I wonder what, what are those type of animals? Is it frogs? Why are there frogs on the mountain wall? Sticky frogs! That explains it. Give me the f goddamn frog. Yeah, I'm failed. Started gliding for some reason. Okay, now I have explored that cave that you talked about. I know you worked up an appetite. Oh. There are caves at the bottom of this hill. I used to go mushroom. While you were building... I thought you wanted mushrooms. Or is it I like, gonna use those mushrooms to be able to oh. open it? My apologies, the door won't open for some reason. So I've... What, what type of mushrooms did I find there? I find... Uh, I found the... Uh, these ones. Right? Glowing effect to anyone who eats it. <sighs> I need to cook it also. Uh, I'm a bit lost on what I what I'm supposed to I'm not lost, I'm just stupid. <laughs> I understand exactly what I'm gonna do. So first of all, we need to know when we're above it. So let's aim there. Nice. And then go into the cave and then we should just ascend. Yeah, I have already forgotten that ability. <laughs> Even though I used it yesterday. Did my, ugh, my yellow thingy went away, that's not good. Let's just try to line up here, I guess, then. Ah, or is it I missed a part? That also can be the explanation to why I didn't find what I was searching for. So let's add a rock to my sturdy... Oh, 
This explains it more. Because now we're probably, yeah, we're directly underneath it. What is this? So wait, 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 wait. Can I... If I... Destroy this fuse? And I wanna fuse with this big boulder? Nice. That, that's a lot of more damage. That's a lot of damage. And here we have the froggy type. Something happened with my OBS when I was recording, so... I just noticed that I haven't been recording for some minutes. So what I have done, you see I've unlocked it. So what I did, what I did do, because I... I guess I... Yeah, you've seen that I figured... Figured out where we would go. And that was the correct thing, so I just... I went here, as you all saw, and then you saw the froggy thingy. So I, I re reviewed wh where it stopped. So you saw the froggy thingy here. Uh, I killed it, I took these things, and then I just used the beam on this round platform, because it was a bit sus. <laughs> and then when I got here, I saw two sticks, like, blocking the door on each side here to open it up. So I just moved them. And then I opened it up and this bird fixed the, the thing with some oil, he said. And then I saw that I hadn't recorded the last couple of minutes, so... Now we're, now we're backtracked. And here we are. Sorry for that little inconvenience. I'm really not sure how it... Because also... It recorded for 30 minutes, then it stopped for some for a few seconds, and then it started recording for 5 minutes, and then it stopped altogether. So I got two files uh, on the last recording. Oh well. Sometimes technology have a life on its own, I guess. A lot of sky islands over here. Okay. Let's think for a bit. Where could it be... ...stables? I feel like a stable could be in this type of like crossroad or maybe here as well. Should we explore if it's if it's maybe over here? Let's put a pin there and on the way we can do this shrine also. Let me <laughs> go the right way. That's not the right purple, yeah. That's the... this is the right way. Is that a stable? No, I don't think so. Maybe it is. Yeah, it is a stable. My reasoning was correct. Nice. Let's just drop down here. Do this shrine. And then let's go to the stable. And hopefully somehow either learn how to get a horse or get a horse. <sighs> okay. Okay. Uh, let me 
go up here. And we just rest for a quick second here. Thank you. That was close of it taking damage. Large Sonia charge. Damn. Do we want to grab this with us? No. Feels like uh, the, the shrine here will have some kind of theme with uh, the spring. Maybe. It's not impossible. Because usually the themes are... Like the, the area around it can have the same theme. Bouncy device, yeah. So don't tell me I needed to get it now. This will this has enough force to throw me up. And here I'm wondering, do they want me to take this one with them with me? So now I can attach it to um uh, That wasn't enough. Okay, it responds. That's good at least. So I guess... We're gonna take this and we're gonna use it on this one right here. Can we even attach it? No. Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> I think that's how they wanted me to do it. Yeah. The ball. The ball should go there. Can we attach on this? Or should we just rotate it? I guess in here. Just to make it safe. Yeah. This is like an introduction to how to use this thingy. Hmm. This looks a bit scuffed. But I guess it's just like a ramp for the ball to go on, and then it will shoot away. I think we want to center it a bit more. That's no good. Bam. And... That's good. Oops. Go into the slot. Nice. And also, I don't want to miss any hidden little... Sorry, my controller <laughs> got unplugged. Somehow. Nice. So does... Is this used now? Oh, we can recharge it. Uh, reset it. I guess with me... What the hell is... It's the problem with my controller. A lot of problems. Nice. And hit it. 
Yeah, I thought that would happen. I guess we can just bump ourselves straight up and then just use our our glider. Okay, so that's the finish. Where is the the chest? Or have I? I'm like, have I found the chest already? I don't think so. My memory cannot be that bad. there no okay let's just try to go up then when it's two is it like both get activated together there is the chest that's good so it's not my memory that's bad it's just or it's bad because I didn't <laughs> remember if I found one or not but that's the ADHD brain. It doesn't always think about the details. Okay, so use those two, but we're gonna attach one more to boost it even further. So, attach. That's a bouncy dude. <laughs> uh, not the greatest attachment from my part. There we go. That wasn't so hard, huh? And we're done. That's clean. Pretty clean, cleanly... ...done by me, if I could say it myself. We have six of those. No, it was one more shrine on the way out here, on the way to the stable. Oh, what is this purple thingy? It's just some weirdly placed pin by me. Mm -hmm. Ah, that's the crossroad that I was uh, theorizing that the uh, stable would be. Sure, if is that one done earlier by me? No. Can my purple crossroad thing go away? I thought it would go away automatically by just flying over it, but it did not. And also, I'm gonna cook over at the stable, so we can get some food, but I'm gonna do it after I end this episode. <laughs> Are you gonna charge me? I come in peace here. I just want to go get to my shrine. The Tukarok Shrine. Let's start with doing this.
some type of ball should go in there, I guess. There it is. Oh, that's a big, big boy. Big wheels. Can we attach it here? <laughs> Took some damage. Maybe we should turn off the wheels first. Let's grab it with us. I'm not sure if we're gonna use it or not. Okay. So we should put the wheel... ...on some type of carrying thing. Just experiment for a bit. Okay, I, I think I I think I get it. Oops. sure what that was supposed to achieve. Can I attach it, maybe? Okay. Yes, this one is in the way a bit for now. So this one cannot attach on the... Okay, okay, I, I think I understand. That makes <laughs> actually no sense at all. Uh, let me think here. If I turn it on... So far... I'm with it. And then we need something to grip as a... Only like this? Is that what they want? And... Ah. 
<laughs> Don't run away from me, Will. Is that everything? We need uh, two wheels. Okay. Some great. What happens if we do like this then? I feel like we're getting closer at least. I s swear that this is not how you should is, are supposed to do this. Should it run on the side, maybe? Okay. I don't think this is the correct way, but um, <laughs> I'm lost for ideas at the moment. Some kind of... Ah. Oh, so it can be good to... <laughs> Do it like this. <laughs> The hell? Okay. Let's see if we can MacGyver this in my own weird way. Oh no, the ball. Bye bye. Okay, we can still get it. Take the not that one. We take this one with us. Okay, yeah, that's that's not even possible. Mm-hmm. Is this what they want from me? 
That looks more correct, to be honest. Then, then I can't attach the wheel as I want, so that's... <laughs> it's not correct that even. Ah, my god. Why am I so slow today? In my brain. back at the first thing I I was trying but maybe it actually only is if I do it like that and then grab and then I go up it actually bounces on each thing okay Gonna destroy my sword before we're even done here. Is this possible? Okay, we just need to lower it a bit. I think this is what they want me to do. Just lower it slightly. And even put it lower here. Maybe. But now it's way too low. But we're starting to get there. Now <laughs> we just need to... Apply it on a better spot. Maybe there. Is this too much? But now it doesn't... Maybe. Probably not, but maybe. Ah, look at this, but the ball is not with me. <laughs> oh, of course. Of course. This whole thing has tilted me out now. Okay. I'm shaking my head over here. Okay, nice. Here I should be able to reach it, I think. But the game doesn't agree. Let me get some more height then. Ah, it slowly moves backwards. We can just wait here. Maybe we can get up the ball. Yeah, now it drops. I just needed to wait for that, I guess. Okay. Freaking eternity later. Great. Now I can't reach it with the spear. Okay. Uh, 
And look at that. Success. No success. <laughs> like what are your problem, dude? Is it too heavy now? Okay, so let me just... Nice. Hopefully we have time. And that took way, 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 way too long. Isn't this just to center it? And then just hit it? If only, huh? Let me just get some... Some height. So I can think for a bit. There's a chest. Strong so nice wood, that's nice. So if we just grab this whole piece. This piece. Thing is, I don't think they are going forward in the water. Okay. Ah, oh, damn. That was not planned. Gimme. Is it supposed to be here? I think it's supposed to... To like, go on the rail. Yeah. And... Uh, does that work? Um... <laughs> Uh, hmm. Almost worked. Can I please grab it? Okay, if yeah, I see I haven't centered it also. So if we just put it there, keep the wall, uh, the, the, it's too much shit in my way. Mm-hmm. 
wonder if I should have used these uh, other trees to like big build a platform or something. But this doesn't look so so safe. But if all of those are on the same thingy, and then the most important thing, center the ball. So you have even distribution of the weight. I would say that's pretty centered. Oh my god, that's 50-50, if it works. It worked, nice. I don't have to... Embarrass me my myself anymore here. Don't... Don't, please... Ball. <laughs> Damn, that was so close of me tilting off. <laughs> oh my god. And I guess if I jump, does it close? No. That only took an half eternity. Nice. Let's just start with talking to this dude. Welcome to the stable. We deal in all things horse related. Also a double assassin. It seems you're not a member yet. Our stable uses the stable association's membership system. So you'll need to register if you want to use it. May I ask for your name? Link. Alright Mr. Link. There. You're all signed up. Now would you like to tell me about the stable system? Please. And allow me to explain. You can board any horse companion with us and then summon them as you please from our network of stables. You may have come across wild horses during your travels. If you catch one and ride it here to register it, it will become your horse companion. There's a limit on how many horses you can board, but you're able to swap them in and out as you oh. please. Once again, welcome to our stable. If you catch a wild horse and bring it here, you can register it. If you want to lodge with us, please visit the counter inside. How can I help you? Catching horses. It's simple enough. To catch a wild horse, just approach it from behind slowly. That was what I was uh, trying to do the first episodes. Uh, slowly, so it doesn't hear you coming and hop on. If you really want to be sneaky, approach it while crouching. Of course, these are wild animals we're talking about. The horses you're riding might start to act up. If that happens, try soothing it. It will eventually settle down and then you can bring it to me. Now it may take time. Now it may <clears throat> now it may take a while for a wild horse to get used to being ridden. They may change direction or slow down on their own until you earn their trust and respect. If your horse disobeys your direction, you will you'll want to gently redirect it and then calm it. And if you continue interacting that way, your horse will naturally begin to trust you and become more obedient. That's all I can tell you about the subject, friends. Oh. Anything else? No, not for now. Uh, I completely forgot to explain how pony points works. What's that? That's right, it's a reward system you can use at stables. In short, every time you use a service, you get points, like a membership point. No matter what stable you go to, you can get points for lodging, registering a horse, stuff like that. Here's a little something to mark your first visit to Wetland Stable. You get a pony point. 
Pony point card. Using a stable, earn points. Collecting points grant rewards. Point, points needed to next reward two. Mm. Save up points to earn a wagon load of wonderful rewards for you and your horse companion. Mm. You can trade your pony points for prices at the ledger counter over there. Check out the ledger for price de details, member rules, and other information. Oh. Come back anytime. A lot of talking. I'm probably gonna buy a horse over there if I have money for it. Receive reward. Mm. Ah, yes, I'll be right with you. I know I can't receive mm. one, but I want to see what I can get. You like to get a pony? Oh. You can use to talk up. Blah blah blah. Okay, I need. Uh, I can't see the prices. I need to. To collect the points first. So let's talk to this dude. Well, good morning, Mr. Uh, Mr. Customer, sir. Word to the vice. Even though it's daytime, I'd stay away from the forest near here if I were you. Uh, we got a monster problem, a scary one. Moved in and made a forest. I mean, fortress. I mean, fortress. Anyway, it's bad. Bad news. And it bought, brought some other monsters with it. And look. I think I saw them earlier, yeah. I worked so hard to build a well, and now I can't even use it. I mean, it's not that hard to make a new well, but... What if this monster decides to raid us? I can't sleep, I can barely talk. I thought maybe I'd try to sneak attack from behind, you know? Stay out of their field of view. It did not go well. If someone could do at least... If someone could at least get that big one to leave... We'll keep wishing, but for now... You really should steer clear of that forest. Uh, I wanna... Can I talk to you again? Okay, this is just the same. I thought you could buy horses. This place, but may, I might remember incorrectly. It's a good chance I remember incorrectly. Let's see what this dude sells. He sells things. And he buys things. Start checking what he got. Some arrows. Yeah. Let's sell some of my stones. Sell one of each. With that little income boost, I think um, this episode has a good good finish point here. So in the next episode, let's clear that forest for that sh short dude over there. And also, let's try to get a horse on next episode. It's time to get one. I hope you have enjoyed watching this episode. Please consider liking and subscribing if you haven't already. This has been 23. Uh, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. <laughs>